Um, okay, so we're at the Robert Verdi Lounge during New York Fashion Week, and Robert Verdi just launched a brand new show called The Robert Verdi Show, starring... Robert Verdi! Robert Verdi! What else would we call it? <laughs> so, how's the show going so far, the first... Great. It just it just premiered, and it's it's going really well. It's gotten a great response. I think pe I think people get it, and it could just be the people who are talking to me that get it, because I think what people were expecting was another makeover show, another fashion show, and what there are so many of them, and it's really a comedy show. That's the idea was to create a comedy that was sort of a send up of all the other reality shows and. I kind of feel like I'm giving away the secret when I talk about it too much, but that's what the show's concept was, was how do you make reality funny um, and not treat it like it's so serious. It is funny. And it's not serious. It is right. It's reality. Yeah. It's who you are. I'm crazy. You're a funny man. Yeah. I'm crazy, and, it get, and, it, and it's definitely given away in the show. We definitely see Keith into my insane mind, which is why we crack open my head. Because people always say, at least people who I'm going to, not necessarily people who work with me, but people who I'm pitching creative ideas to always say to me in memes, what's going on inside of your head? Yeah. And so that's why there's a sequence in the show every every episode where you go inside my head and see my thoughts. Which is amazing. You dress celebrities. All the places. Who did you trust your fashion week? Nobody. Nobody. Um, no, actually, I'm not doing anybody for the Oscars. I do have more, I do have television people in the movie people, so I, I work with um, Eva Longoria. Eva Longoria. I work Eva with Kristen Wiig from Southern Podcast. Kathy Griffin. Kathy Griffin. Can we talk about her at, uh, what was she just on? The Grammys, we're in Carolina Herrera. Carolina said uh, no. She was really thrilled. Thank you. Kathy Griffin at the Grammys. She was one of the best dressed of my life. I covered her on BBC as well. I covered her as Monday News on BBC as well because I thought she looked. Amazing. And she gave you a shout out. She did give me a shout out. She's a good actor. She's a good friend of mine. We started out working together. We did the red carpet. We actually worked on the red carpet for me together. And she had just launched her show. And I did something for her behind the scenes. And she and I just hit it off and became really good friends. And it was a couple of years before she, she, she said to me after dinner, she said, Would you ever think about working with me and dressing me? And I said, Sure. Like, it was nothing, nothing for me. Like there was not, not we didn't miss a beat. We started working together. It was really great. And now one more thing. Um, the fashion tape. What's on your top five? Fashion. Yeah, fashion. Right from Robert Verdi. Fashion tips. Okay, get ready because I haven't seen a thing yet. Okay. I've seen bits and pieces. Um, I think we're gonna see Granny Boots. I might not be able to give you five things. I think it's a I think it's a dark season. I think you're gonna see a lot of. A lot of dark and classic. There's a lot of caramel, there's a lot of charcoal gray, there's a lot of black. Um, I think corsets. There's something happening that we're seeing a lot of very defined, serious waistlines. There's a little bit of a nod to the 80s because you're seeing peppers like Alexis Carrington used to wear. And incidentally, Alexis Bittar put um, Joan Collins in his new ad campaign, which is really fun and off the wall and fantastic. But that's a real nod to the A. So I think you're seeing platforms. And I think there's going to be a continuation of ruffles. We're seeing a lot of ruffles. And feminine details are still there. Yeah, and very flirty. I think those are five things. And I don't know that they're the strongest things, but they're five things that I've seen cropping up consistently. Okay, fantastic. Well, thank you so much. Congrats on your show. Thank you. Season two. Season two. Ask for it. Beg for it. Wish for it.